Hello everyone, this is Aura. Today I'm going to be following up my video I did with Vante a couple of days ago as some of the original plans for the future of Fabulous Aura have changed and I wanted to jump more into what I'm currently going through. Before we delve into any of that though, I'd like to just quickly say if any of you are currently battling with depression, other mental issues, disorders, or are having thoughts of suicide, know that there are people who can help you. That's why both on screen and in the description you can find the phone numbers for both the suicide prevention hotline and the national helpline. Please give them a call and believe it or not, you matter, even when it doesn't feel that way. Okay, so in the previous video with Vante, we talked about how going forward I would no longer be doing the same kind of content I've been doing on Fabulous Aura going forward, except for a few pre-recorded videos, and that I also would be focusing more on my main channel. As an addition to that plan, all the previous content I've done on Fabulous Aura would also stay up on the channel for people to continue watching. However, those plans have changed. As I can't seem to get myself to edit those videos when slash if I have the time, also most of the content on the channel has now been privatized and a lot of my off-site videos have gone dark, meaning they've either been privatized, disabled, or deleted. Which thank you by the way to all the people who've supported my decision to move on from this kind of content. I feel that some people however are very confused by this declaration and all these sudden changes, which I feel I should at least explain a few of the reasons I came to a lot of these decisions and let you guys know that this wasn't something I decided overnight. Okay, some of you guys already know this as I've been open about it in the past that I've dealt with mental issues due to both mental and physical trauma for basically my entire life. For the past several years, however, I've been battling with severe depression, which has also led me to having severe nervous breakdowns and even thoughts of suicide. At a point, I was so scared of myself and everything around me that for a while, anything that reminded me of death or sadness, whether it be a song, movie, or video game, caused me to go into full-blown panic and anxiety attacks. If you want to know how bad it got, this will sound completely ridiculous, but even killing other players in Minecraft could send me into anxiety attacks depending on the day I was having. I spoke with a couple of therapists and counselors around this time it originally started occurring and have been often on multiple different antidepressants over the years as well, except at a certain point my brain decided instead of dealing with what I was going through, it would rather block out a lot of the worst things I've dealt with and was feeling. So from 2017 to this year, I've been in a complete mental haze and shut myself off to be by myself both mentally and physically, as my brain just chose to try not and think much of anything, which was not only very unhealthy, but also was only a temporary solution. As earlier this year, around the time my grandma passed away, and after dealing with some of the most awful experiences I've ever had in my life in just the past two years, a lot of those same thoughts and feelings all came rushing back. I suddenly was very disgusted and scared of myself all over again, which resulted in me having another nervous breakdown, and I had no idea who I really was anymore. I was completely lost, which now I am working with therapists again to try and deal with this again, just this time in a more healthier way. Around the time I went into this mental haze was around the same time I started uploading frequently to this channel. And ever since I started uploading frequently to this channel, I've had many doubts that have popped up in my head from time to time as well. What if my channel gets taken down? Do I really want to continue doing this? Am I proud of myself for doing this? Which at the time I thought was a yes and kept making up excuses for why I thought it was. A mixture of all of this has however put my mental state in a very weird state where I am finally working on moving forward even if it has been very challenging in getting my life together. However, on the other hand, me trying to work through this and addressing a lot of the stuff that my mind had blocked out has made me a lot more fragile and a lot more critical of myself lately. It's also led me to losing sleep due to a lot more frequent panic or anxiety attacks. Mixing this with me going to class and helping my mom out a lot, I've been so stressed that I've been on the verge of shutting down again, which 
I don't want to do. So I am currently taking it one day at a time and am trying to deal and change a lot of the things in my life while trying to get into a healthy state. One of those things I decided to change was this channel, as those feelings, thoughts, and questions from before all started coming back. This time, however, instead of making an excuse, I finally decided something I knew a long time ago. No, I don't want to keep doing this. I'm not proud of the direction my content has headed. At least, not anymore. The content I've done for this channel, the content I've done off-site for this channel, have all become triggers for my anxiety, as it is now a reminder of how dark of a place I was in. Eventually, when I'm in a better mental state, I will re-publicize the videos, but not in my current state. I need a break from it. I don't want to stop making content altogether, though. I want to start posting content on my main channel, content from the me that is now, more of the content I have always loved doing, even before I started this channel, before I even went into this mental state. Recording and editing Steven Universe Attack the Light for My Name is Zora is some of the most fun I've had in a long time, and this time I know for sure it's genuine. Because Fabulous Aura has always been an uncertainty. Something I would state was fun, but I no longer know if it was or I just was trying to trick my own brain into thinking that. That's why I've made this decision, but even now, it isn't an easy one to make. Part of me wants to forget about this decision and just keep moving on with what I've been doing, but I know that's just my brain wanting to continue hiding in its comfort zone. That's my brain trying to find the easy out. But dealing with this stuff and getting past it is never easy. But of everyone eventually has to. The longer you put off trying to deal with it in a healthy way, the more awful you feel. The longer you have to deal with it, and it will eventually find its way out anyway. And you've wasted up to years of your life hiding instead of taking those problems head on and moving past them. I do want to say sorry to the people and fans I'm letting down by making this decision, but it's one that I've needed to make for a very long time now. Hopefully, I'll eventually find myself in a better mental state. That way, I can make even better videos for you guys, bring a smile to your face, and be a better version of Aura. I also hope that by me sharing this story, that if any of you are in a situation similar and battling your own inner demons, this helps you seek help to start the battle, to take your life back, and for you to realize you matter. Trust me, I know how difficult it is to deal with and acknowledge what you are going through, but you can get past it. You just need to do it the healthy way, by talking with someone, which again, I have the numbers for both the Suicide Prevention Hotline and the National Helpline if you are having these issues. Please call them or at least reach out to someone you are close to. This is all I really have to say. I did originally plan on having a few more updates in this video, but I feel those should wait for another time. Maybe one day I'll even go into detail about everything that's happened in my life. But for now, guys, thank you so much for everything. Stay fabulous.